Hi everybody, it's me, Ash, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here and want to see more crafty related videos, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and choose your preference on how you'd like YouTube to notify you of my videos. <clears throat> so today, <clears throat> we are back with an AliExpress haul. It's been a while since I did one of these. Um, it's I've had these for a while. I've just been saving them because I've had plenty of videos to put out. So we're just going to go ahead and go through what I got. Um, it's pretty much all dyes. And then a couple other things. So I'm just going to show the two other things that are not dyes um, first. Um, actually, you know what? I think... Where is that at? I think I have another dye as well that I need to show you guys that I have. And a different place. So let's see if I can find that more fast. Um, this is like the worst time to put out this video, but I promise that these were all purchased way before this virus outbreak pandemic thing happened. Um, and I've had them before this all happened. I've used um, a couple of them in previous videos. That's how long I've had these. So you'll notice some, um, if you keep up with my videos, you notice the ones that I've been using a lot, like in these cards that you see off to the side here. That's why I'm trying to find the one out. Where's my other one? Emery just used it the other day, so it might be in. Might be in there. Um, I'll just, you know what, I'm not going to dig for it. I'm just going to get. Oop, I'm just avalanching it. I'm just going to get a card that it was used on. Okay, so the first one is this Thanks die. Um, that is one of them that. I got and I don't want to search around to find it but that's what it looks like when it's cut out um, the next things I'm going to show you are these right here um, these ones I thought were something else but they ended up being just numbers really let me see if I can get some out but they're like these vintage looking little squares and circles um, of numbers. I didn't think they were numbers. I thought they were something else. But I'm sure I can figure it out. Like little tickets with some Chinese writing on them. Stuff like that. So that was the first thing that I got. Like I said, I was not expecting these to look like this to be numbers pretty much but I'll figure out a way to use them if not I will happy mail them there's a couple other ones that were in there and these are just like days of the week so I'm guessing this is would be something that would go in like a planner um so yeah that's this one. This one actually came um, what I thought it was going to be. So, they are stickers and they're like antique ish stamps. And um, they do have some in English. I think I saw, which are like famous paintings, I guess. I don't know if I've seen any Japanese. Oh, I guess there is some Chinese ones. Like this one right here. That's in Chinese. But they were underneath vintage stamps. And so I just grabbed them up. I thought they'd be fun just to place randomly on some projects. There's a couple more in there. So there's 45 in this box. I don't know how much is in the other ones. The other ones are called retro stickers. Um... 
And it doesn't say how many is in that box, I don't think. No, not that I can tell. If it does, it's in Chinese, so. Um, those are the two non dies that I got. I do have some more stuff that's supposed to be coming shortly, but I figured I'd just do those in a separate video because there is a lot in this one. My cats are yelling at the puppy, if you're wondering what that noise is. So this one right here is like a file folder pocket so over on the side on the sides it's like an accordion style to where you'd fold an accordion and it turns it into like a file folder pocket next is this die I actually got a bundle deal to save prices I couldn't help it I thought they were super cute and I love how tiny they are because they just make really perfect things for anything, even a card. This one right here, um, it's butterflies, and it's a corner butterfly, so some of them, like, it cuts out the butterflies, but it leaves the middle, so it makes it to where it pops out of the, um, the paper. So, like, it cuts into the paper, but it doesn't fully cut them out. Next is the Hello one. You've seen me use these on um, the little cards that I did with the piano paper. Um, this one right here is just stitched edged um, rectangles. Nothing too special about that one. This one is a family of deer. Um, they cut out separately but they don't break apart. Now, the next ones I'm going to show you all came together in a set. So, it's this tree die right here, this tree die, and this house one. Um, so, the trees I have cut out because I've been using them for a swap. So the one tree makes it to where you can fold these up to stick off your paper. The other one is that, and you can layer them if you want. I've learned that one. You can layer them. The other one is just three um, cartoonish looking ones, and then the houses, which you can separate, but I leave them together. I have used all of these dies because I'm doing a die swap. So I do know these cut out all pretty well. And this is how long it's been, you guys, because that's obviously Christmas. This That's when I ordered these. This one makes a really cute Santa. Um, so, like, this is his beard, and then you have his hat, the bell, and then this is his face. Um, I will have the link to all of these in my description box so you can see what they really look like whenever they're being used. But this is a really cute Santa. It's like a vintage-y looking one. Um, super cute. Love it. Next is what you've seen me use are these um, like torn vintage edge paper squares. I haven't found any circle ones or anything like that in these. I wish I could find more in different shapes, but these are the only ones that I've seen, and I absolutely love this die. I've been using it on everything. Um, oops, that's not. And these are the last two. So it's like a palm leaf one. Yeah. I haven't used these ones yet, these last two, but the other ones I have used all of them. And then this one is some floral ones because I don't really have too many leafy things to put behind some flowers and stuff like that. So that's what I grabbed. And that is it for my AliExpress haul, you guys. Um, if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. It is super important that you, if you do like my my videos, that you give me a thumbs up. That way it spreads the word of the channel. Um, super excited. We are up to... 459 I think subscribers so we're getting close to that 500 subby giveaway um, I can't wait for it. these journals are so cute and I can't wait for you guys to um, get a chance to win one
Um, but yeah, and don't forget I have my uh, um, my birthday challenge giveaway still. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and until next time, I will see you later. Bye.